Hello everybody, welcome to the dojo. In today's video we'll be talking about pocket knives. I got a few knives here that I want to open and get their first impressions of and then I also have some modifications for them. So I'm not sure which knife is in which box. This knife here is the Cold Steel Chris Voyager. Spyderco Yojumbo. So we're gonna get these knives opened up and take a closer look at them. Now, usually I only buy a knife if it has a pocket opener or a, a wave opener, but these two models don't come standard with the wave opener. Luckily I was able to find a company that makes a modification. I got a Snaggletooth kit this one is the red aluminum, and this one I will be installing onto the Cold Steel Voyager. The other kit that I got, and this is the piece here, and this one is for the Spyderco. So the Snaggletooth aluminum, I will be installing on the Cold Steel Voyager, and the 5x5 combat solutions I'll be installing on the Spyderco. So the first thing we have to do is take off the thumb stud on the cold steel. So I was able to get the thumb stud out with just a vice grip and a needle nose plier. So now I will be installing the Snaggletooth aluminum. It went on super, super easy. It took about two minutes to go on. So now we're gonna go ahead and install the 5x5. All right, so we got the 5x5 installed. It took like 30 seconds to install. So just a quick overview, we got the Cold Steel Voyager with the snaggle tooth and you can still use it like a thumb stud to open it. And I really like the way it looks. It's all metal, aluminum, it's really sturdy. It was really easy to install. The 5x5, it's just beautiful. I like how that looks. I haven't tested this one out yet. But I did try the snaggle tooth and it worked really good. And this is a factory wave, how Cold Steel does it. And then this is an Emerson wave here. If you don't have a wave on your knife, then you're pretty much at a disadvantage because it's so much faster. And if you're going to use a knife in the Jutsu, I recommend having a wave. So let's get these two in the pocket and I'll just show you how they work. So the first one I'm going to try is the Cold Steel Voyager with the snaggle tooth. So as you can see it's in the pocket. And it's open. The next one I'm going to try is the Spyderco Yojumbo. So it's in the pocket. Perfect. Block count them two. In the pocket. The zero tolerance. Another cold steel, this one is the Thai light. So I'm pretty excited to have a spider co and start training with it. And I'm equally excited about this Voyager. And I highly recommend getting a knife. And before you get a knife, try and research what modifications you can do to accommodate your needs. In my case, I have to have a pocket opening knife or I won't carry it. I hope you like my video. Everybody have a good night. Thank you.